There you are, my hunk of a man. You're insane. You know, Mia. You need to, like, get a boyfriend, too. Yeah, I get he's cute, but he's also cute because he has a scar from his girlfriend having some weird brain condition. Besides, aren't you worried about someone important finding out? Who? Your fiancé. Oh, right. I mean, if Celeste didn't want to marry him, I mean, look at her. She decided love was more important than money, and she's the heiress. I just have a boat ton of money. Mm-hmm. As if my fiancé would notice, he's on a business trip all summer. Whatever, I'm gonna go get dinner while you fantasize about this man that you stand no chance with. Oh, trust me, Mia. Money talks. You're hopeless. Hopelessly in love, he leaves me- Alright, I'm out of here. Trust me, a meal will be mine. You look just like me, my true successor. This is confusing. Where's corruption? The islands? You aren't exactly dreaming. I remember this place. Descendant of Hikari. We need to talk. We do? Yes. Fine, then let's talk. Are you planning to use Bora's gift? Your core? I don't know, my life was fine. Then I found out about my magic and it's only been causing me problems. And when I was in my coma, my mom would tell me about my dad, and how he didn't want that for me. Daniel, I still can't believe he named you after me. What do you mean? Your father and I had a special relationship as his ancestor. He truly made sure that I was never forgotten by my bloodline. He didn't want to follow his destiny, as most modern day descendants, but that's not important. You must overtake corruption. And I warn you, danger is here. Overtake corruption? Danger? Nate is here. And I don't know if he's planning something. And if corruption can form a contract with him, it's over. A contract? A major's way of contracting with their partner is the first kiss. Kiss? She is dreaming if she thinks my lips will touch that snake. Shocked he didn't do it sooner, but she was a little murder happy. So then, do you think if I kiss a meal and form a contract- I think you misunderstood. A contract is an imprint of two mages, and a meal is not- Then what am I supposed to do? Hostile takeover. Talk about being cryptic. Then here is a hint. Take over the center.
Okay, I'm just cooking. Ignore that. Everything's fine. It's all just smoke. We're not gonna die. Despite the fact that I'm a terrible cook, we're not gonna die. Uh, my head. What was that all about? Take over the center? A meal? Contracts? How strange. I wonder why I keep having a strange dream. I should probably get dressed. Come on, Rose. The water feels amazing. I'm fine. I'll only go into the water if I need to. Don't be such a wuss, Rose. I'm not. You know I don't like swimming. Yet yeah, you're on the swim team. Why? To get Jeanette to stop taunting me, that's why. Sorry, Hunter. You can try, but unless I have to, I'm not going in there. Oh, unless you have to, huh? <laughs> Hunter! Why did you do that? to give you a reason to join me in the water. Oh, fine, you win. Hunter, stop, no, 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 Hunter. Rose, you're fine. See, you're fine, you won't drown. Uh, um. At least on my watch. You jerk! <laughs> it's so nice. A summer vacation was something I needed. Glad you're enjoying the sun. It's wonderful. You don't get sun like this in the city. <laughs> I'd have to agree. Glad you decided to join me, Cora. You've been kind of disappearing on me a lot lately. Um, you know, I've been enjoying the ocean breeze at night. It's a wonderful thing. So cool. So calm. <laughs> I'm exhausted with that plane ride. Yeah. I'm just ready to hit the hay for the night and enjoy the views in the morning. I even bought a new bathing suit. I'm gonna finish unpacking in the morning. We got a big day tomorrow to explore. Thank for I can get out of here. What was that, Cora? Oh, um, I'm gonna Go take a walk, stretch out my legs, play with a little rough in the leg room. And you know, legs for days. Oh, then alright. Go and enjoy your walk. For sure, I'll go and enjoy that walk. <sighs> I'm so sorry, Amelia. Taylor, I told you I'd call you when I was on my way. Now how much longer? I haven't seen you since we got on the plane. Why have we been talking since we're talking to the apartment? I know, it's just been hard because I don't want Amelia to know. When do you think we can tell her about us? When I feel ready to tell her, I just need to figure something out first. Something about us? Something about me. I'm just going for a very confusing time, Taylor. Alright then, Cora. Take your time, then. I will support you no matter what. Thank you, Taylor. I'll see you soon. See you soon. Cora? Cora! Uh, yeah, what? You fell asleep. I what? Ow. I'm all... You're all burnt. Oh, man. And I have a date tonight. A date? 
With who? With Taylor. Oh, all right then. Come on, I'll help you with that burn. I have a bunch since, you know, I can turn into a total lobster. So I got a bunch of remedies. I may even have something cute for you to wear. I would love that. All right, come along then, a makeover. There you go. Thanks, Jeanette. I reek though. It's the only way at least to get the sting out because you probably hurt. True. Fair enough. All right, let's try to cover up that horrible burn. Jeanette, it's hot and an outfit that will cover this burn will be impossible to tolerate. I know that. I'm saying we need to give you a cute outfit that will blow Taylor away. Try that on. You're adorable! Really? You're missing something, though. What is it? Close your eyes. Perfect! A total beach babe! I look... pretty. You'll knock him off his feet! Jeanette, can we have a heart-to-heart? -heart? Sure! I'm confused. Confused? Confused about what? My feelings. What are you talking about? I may like two people, but I'm not sure if I like, like one or appreciate her for caring for me. Her? You think you like Amelia? She took care of me after my injuries got dangerously infected. She extended my life enough to get proper medical attention. I owe her my life. I see. I'm confused. So... You're trying to figure it out. Well, yeah. And that's okay to be confused. You will know what's right when the time comes. Thanks. I appreciate that. Anything, Cora. Now, go have fun. Let's see here. They seem like the mages to carry magic ingredients on them at all times. The bathroom would be a good place to check. Ah, those scents. There is potion ingredients in here, and the ingredients are fresh. Oh, what's this vial? That colour. It's pink. I'm not the only dirty player. It's a love potion. I wonder to whom. The lovely newlyweds. Don't worry, ladies. I'll make sure your recipients receive your potion. They just won't fall in love with each other.
Hey, newbie. Why were you in that guest's room? I was fulfilling a room service request. The restaurant is slammed. Mm-hmm. Which one? I, uh... Nicolette, pool boy is still new. As if he knows the names. It's probably one of the bars. An educated thought, Leanne. All right, Nate. However, report back to your supervisor. She's been looking for you. Oh, has she now? All right, I will see Viola right away. Christina? Nicolette? Oh, my Vora, it's been forever! What have you been up to? Med school, it's completely taken over my life and the tuition is not cheap. However, they have a program here for me to work as a lifeguard. It's helping reduce the costs. Hey, is this your room? Huh? Y yeah, this is my room. Is anyone in that room now? No, my girlfriend is downstairs waiting for our dinner to be put in boxes. Oh no. Leanne, go get an incident report. But I'm off. You know the policy. What is going on? There was a pool boy in there. He told us that he was there dropping off room service. Are you telling me someone broke into my room? Yeah, I'm going to Paige Viola to witness the incident sighting. Once your girlfriend comes up, we'll take note of your room and see if he has stolen anything, p any possessions. That pool boy is on probation. Pro, pro probation Yeah, according to Viola. Come on. Oh no.